yes welcome to my channel here i will teach you how to make these small sanders it's for a year old child one year old you can see it's very simple just with single crochet you can be able to get it so you can see size 19 to 20 you can see it very simple and nice now i will start by fixing the shoe pad i already made the foundation so now i will fix the shoe pad so here is the shoe pad if you want to learn how to make the foundation and how to crochet on shoe pad you can also view my videos on youtube then then now i will teach you how to fix the shoe pad so make sure that the shoe pad is well arranged on the sole you can see then continue fixing with single crochet you can see it's very simple just single crochet Continue with single crochet, just maintain the single crochet until you go around the sole and end it here. Very simple. Can see how it is very strong Yeah, now I'm done with it. You can see how neat and simple it is. So I will light this rough thread now. Yes. So now I will measure it from the tip in small slanting position. You can see it like this. Let me show you the way you can be able to see it. Can you see it? Here is upper, the here is down. In small slanting position, you can see where I fix this mark here and here. So now I will start by making a knot. make a knot then after making a knot I will make 20 chains from here 20 chains One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 
13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Then after making 20 chains, I will fix it here by slip knit. Then after slip knitting, on the next row, make single crochet. Then you turn. Continue with single crochet until you make eight rounds of single crochet. You know the the chain is still is tinier, so it may be difficult somehow. Single crochet. You can see continue with single crochet. Yes, once you reach the edge, you make single crochet on the first and second hole on the shoe sole. This is one on the next hole two. Two. Then you turn. When you turn, you jump the first hole. You can see this is the first hole and this is the second hole you jump the first hole crochet and the next one single crochet then you take the rough thread in Make sure that the rough thread is hidden. Can you see? Make sure that the rough thread is hidden. can see I'm done with it already eight rounds one two three four five six seven eight eight rounds 
so i'm going to make this one now there are eight it's eight rounds two one two three four five six seven eight so I'll make it separate before I continue with this one. So it's also eight holes on the shoe sole. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I will continue by measuring it with this one, like this. So I have to use the first shoe to measure the second shoe. You can see where the first shoe started from here. Yeah, so because of it, I have to start from here. You can see. Then crochet on eight holes, single crochet. There is the eighth one, so you make one chain, make one chain, turn, and continue with single crochet. You can see continue with single crochet until you make eight rounds eight rounds of single crochet this is the eight rounds so at the end you make one chain and cut You take the rough thread in by passing it through the holes. Then you light it off. Yeah, you can see it now. So now I will crochet from here to here. Exactly what I did here. So I will start by counting up the first and the second hole. I will count out the first and the second hole, then start on the third one. Make chains, 20 chains. Then fix it here. The same thing I did here. Count one, two, off. Then start on the third one. Then to start, I will make a knot. Then after making a knot, I will count out the first and the second hole. Then start on the third one. 
make 10 chains. Sorry, I made the mistake before. 10 chains, not 20 chains. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. You can see 10 chains. Then you, the same thing, you cut off the first and the second hole of this. Then start on the on the third one. You see it. Then make slip knit. The first, then on the next hole too. You slip knit. Then you turn, turn, jump the two slip knits, the first and the second slip knit. Then start with the next hole. One, two, then the next hole. Single crochet. So I will continue with it until I make it five rounds. Until I make it five rounds. So at the end, you make the same slip knit, the first and the second whole slip knit, turn, jump the first and second slip knit, then continue with single crochet until you make five rounds of single crochet. Can you see it now? Yeah, this is the fifth round. So slip knit on the last hole. You make one chain. Make one chain, then cut and light it. Then light it off. Yeah, you can see it now. So now I will make the same thing I make here. I will do it here too. So I have to measure the same line with this one. Exactly here. So end it up from here like this. It's so about eight holes. Two, four, six, eight. So eight holes. Yeah, you can see I'm done with it. So I'm going to crochet here. So I start from here. Yeah, I will start by making a knot.
Then after making a knot, I will make 19 chains. Nineteen chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. So here, nineteen chains. So we fix it here. We slip knit. Then slip knit on the next hole too. Either slip knit or single crochet. Anyone can work. Then you turn. Continue with single crochet and to make six rounds of single crochet six rounds exactly what i did here yeah i'm done with it you can see it so now i'm going to make the belt i'm not going to crochet the belt you can see it so i will count off one, two, then three, three holes. Then we start on the fourth hole. I will make 30 chains. After making 30 chains, continue with single crochet. I to make five rounds of single crochet to get the belt. You can see it's five in number. One, two, three. Four, five five rounds you can see well I'm still on the third round Yes, I'm done with it. You can see it. So now I will put the work over here. So I will fix this. It's called magic tape. You can see how the thing works. can see so now I will fix this one here this one will be here then this one will be here so that if I fix it here they will come together Like this yeah yeah thanks for watching this video please if you love this video subscribe below this video on the subscribe button for more videos on crochet